smoking ruin after a fire, described at the time as just like something from the Blitz. Twice since then, it's come close to demolition. Now, one of the South's great cultural and architectural assets has been saved by a million-pound lottery grant. The money will help to restore the new Theatre Royal in Portsmouth and build a new creative learning centre in memory of the late writer and director, Anthony Mingella, who lived on the Isle of Wight but who went to school in the city. Kerry Swain has more. To the new Theatre Royal. Champagne celebrations. A million pound grant from the Heritage Lottery Fund demands a toast with the real thing. Among those raising a glass, a famous face who performed here. It's going to be absolutely terrific. It's going to be a huge jewel in the sort of Hampshire crown. So I'm, I'm, I'm very, very excited about it. The new Theatre Royal's elegant facade in the centre of Portsmouth gives little clue as to why the cash is so badly needed. The scene at the back reveals all. In 1972, a terrible fire destroyed the rear of the building. The safety curtain prevented it spreading to the front. Today, brambles take centre stage on the neglected back lot, but finally, after 40 years of campaigning, the passionate supporters of this theatre have won the money to rebuild. The stage will come out. At the moment, the stage is within the auditorium, so we actually create a stage. We have dressing rooms instead of our lovely porter cabins. It'll be iconic, it'll be modern, it'll be exciting building at the back. We're going to take the improvisation on even further this time. A Shakespeare workshop for school children. The new development will include a creative learning centre for use by local groups, strengthening links with the community. Dedicated to the memory of the award-winning director and former Portsmouth schoolboy, Anthony Mingella. His very first acting moments took place here and when um, we heard about this fabulous project, I knew that it would be one of the most fitting and, and remarkable tributes to him if it was named after him and we're so excited. From different angles, this is how the new buildings will slot in. Portsmouth University students will use part of the site. Twice in the 40 years since the fire, this theatre has narrowly escaped demolition. Now its future is secure. Work will start in the spring and should be completed by the end of 2013. This is Kerry Swain on stage at the new Theatre Royal in Portsmouth for Meridian tonight.